Okay, da haben wir die Medusa. Die habe ich gesucht. Okay. I've got to find out what Mother was trying to do with her. The Medusa. A hero armed with a sword. Hmm. A hero with a lantern. And the last one holding a shield. I'll stake my life on it. All the statues form a single scene together. The poor devils are about to face the beast. Let's give them a helping hand. Ach so, okay. Aber die kann ich ja nicht drehen, oder? So, was haben wir hier noch? Noch ein Bild? A painting with no name. Okay. So, ach, jetzt kann ich den anklicken. Okay. Schwert untersuchen. Start ach, Statue kann ich drehen. Ich untersuche mal. Das ist der einzige, der sich ein Schwert hält. Es scheint sicherlich, dass er der Mann, der seinen Job ist, ihre Kopf aufzunehmen. Also, das Schwert geht zu der Medusa. Okay. Zum Helm mit dem Schild bestimmt nicht. Zum Medusa drehen wir den. Scheint zu stimmen, wenn er das so schon so andeutet. Da haben wir den Medusa-Kopf. Jetzt ist die Frage, wo guckt er hin? Den lassen wir mal so. Oh, da ist ein Buch. Schauen wir mal rein vorher. Hier gibt es ein paar Tipps. The Origin of Myths. A reinterpretation of legendary creatures. Just what I need. The text is in French on the left hand page and in Latin on the right hand. Let's find the chapter on the Medusa. Mm, Französisch. This version is significantly different from the regular one. It recounts how men have always belittled women in society. Harpies, <coughs> the mermaids, the chimera, the hydra, the gorgons. Okay. Ah, the section on the Medusa. While some of the heroes divert attention from the gorgon, the hero with the sword brandishes his weapon at the Medusa. Okay, der Schwert setzt es an. Okay, und der? Der wendet den Blick ab. Oder, äh, welcher? Da sind doch noch zwei. So, er wendet den Blick ab. Warte mal, wie war denn das im Film? Ah, da oben ist noch was. Komme ich sogar ran. Na gut, nehmen wir mal. I couldn't have hoped for better. Ja, Gelee, das ist gut. So, er... Im Video damals war das so... Äh, ich mach mal das. To vanquish the beast, the statues have to be lined up in a specific order. What can the shield be for? To protect its holder? Why not? But in that case, what's the lantern for? Step back and take a second, Louis. Be logical, but open-minded. Think outside the box. Nobody said a statue has to have only one use. I wonder if the lantern was to distract the Medusa. This shield can both protect the holder and also reflect the light from the lantern to distract the beast. In other words, I'll have to make an angle of 90 degrees between the lantern and the Medusa by turning the shield to face the sword. If Mortimer's the one who thought of all this stuff, then honestly, he must have a screw loose. Crazy idea. Genau. Worth a shot. Ähm, die muss ich drehen, die Statue. Zum, zum Held, zum Held mit dem Schwert. Er spiegelt es, so war das im Film. Ich glaube zur Laterne, oder? Nee, das ist zu so gerade. Mal gucken, ob das funktioniert. Ich glaube nicht, dass das funktioniert. Mal gucken. Er muss, er muss definitiv, da bin ich mir sicher, zum Schild gedreht werden. Weil der hat im, in dem zweiten Film, Kampf der Titanen, glaube ich, war das, da hat er sie geblendet mit dem Schild, aber es funktioniert nicht. Oder muss sie auch gedreht werden, weil sie guckt jetzt zum Schwert, Fuzzi. Die kriegt den ja nicht mit, weil er hinterrücks kommt. Und sie wird geblendet. Die wird nur geblendet, wenn das Schild anguckt. Looks right, but nothing's happening. Nichts passiert. In this position, the hero with the shield is just dazzling his colleague. So, den habe ich doch zur Minusa gedreht, oder? Genau, die ist bei der Medusa. Hoppala. So, das kann nur richtig sein, da bin ich mir sicher. So, er ist zum Schild. 
zu Medusa machen ist Schwachsinn. Und er soll reflektieren. Und in dem Winkel kann er natürlich nicht reflektieren. Ähm, er reflektiert am besten, wenn er schräg steht. So, dann strahlt er die an. So müsste es sein, oder? Ja, perfekt. Oh, ich bin gut. Sehr schön. War richtig. Geil. Was passiert jetzt? Wow, wow geil. Indiana Jones. <lacht> Wie geil ist das denn? Sehr geil. Geheimer Kein Geheimer Raum. For Pete's sake, Emily. You scared the pants off me. Don't ever do that again. Well, keep your nose out of my business then. I don't know what you're talking about. Stop fooling around and tell me what you're doing here. Mm -hmm. Soll ich ehrlich antworten? Ja, ich antworte. I discovered a hidden message from my mother. She explains how to find the secret room. Something must have attracted her here, so I've come to check it out. And you? What brings you here? My, you're curious. Let me guess. Go on then, impress me. You're looking for somebody. <laughs> Your silence speaks volumes. I must have got it right. And you will go to great lengths to find them. So, this person means a lot to you. Well, no matter. I'll tolerate your presence this one time. Now, since you're here, make yourself useful. Look around on your side. I'll do the same on mine. And if you find anything of interest, let me know. Oh yeah, in your dreams. At your service, man. <lacht> Die sucht bestimmt nach uns. Sie ist heimlich in uns verliebt. Okay. The heavenly symbols refer to Pandora's box. Emily, okay. I'm pretty sure I've got Pandora's box. Of course you have. You see an earthen pot and you immediately assume it can only be Pandora's box. <laughs> Logical. <laughs> What I like about you, Louis, is that you never fail to surprise me. Ich mach dir einfach Moth. What if I open the jar? Would that then make man responsible <laughs> for all the evils? Try. It'll make a change. <laughs> Alright, can we move on now? <laughs> I do love your irony, but honestly, are you ever impressed by anything you see? By a chamber pot? No, you really do need to do better than that. <laughs> okay. Ja, Bücher ist nichts zu sehen. Hier ist was. Golden Fleece. Golden Fleece. Hercules. It's freezing. Hurry up. Do you think that can really be Jason's golden fleece? No, you are aware that Jason and the Argonauts is a myth, aren't you? But Mortimer has been protecting this hide. It must be of great value, don't you think? Certainly of historical value. This kind of hide is still used by gold diggers in Eastern Europe. Now you see how easy it is to obtain a legend. Why do you have to act so nonchalant every time I show you something? Louis, anyone can kill a sheep, rip off its hide and say it's the golden fleece. <laughs> You're at Lord Mortimer's, not at some farmyard fair. You're just too skeptical. And you have a tendency to believe anything. <laughs> Talk about <laughs> an unlikely pair. Yet, you know opposites attract, don't you? <laughs> an unofficial gospel? Vatican. You'd be more likely to find this kind of book at the Vatican. Nothing special. The library at Buckingham has three. I bet you've read them cover to cover. Naturally. Really? I'm curious. Tell me, what part stood out the most to you? The passage where Mary says to Joseph, Hey, you, shut up. In other words, you haven't even opened one. Ah, geil. Eine Pistölchen? Ein Dolch? Sammlermünze gefunden, sehr schön. So, ich guck mir mal hier noch um. Ey, diese Lenkung zum Drehen ist echt doof. Ah, da ist was. Hey, Mortimer ist der Autor dieses Kunst. Er spricht über seine Passion für Kunst. 
Okay, gucken wir mal weiter. Hier fehlt was. Dreierskulptur, da ist wieder was. Ziel das Krone. Guess what I found. The Holy Grail. Older than that. A piece of Noah's Ark. Not that old. This could go on for hours. Just tell me. Caesar's Laurel Reef. I can just see Mortimer dressed in a toga, wearing a laurel wreath, <laughs> strolling around his manor all day long. You have a curious idea of Mortimer. Why? He's eccentric, like all the English are, isn't he? Well, if Peru stands for French grace, then if I were you, I wouldn't be making that sort of remark. <laughs> oh. Looks like a pamphlet on different political regions. Written by Mortimer himself. Oh, Carlos Grosen? You should see the sword, Emily. It's magnificent. I'm busy. Describe it to me. Orleon. It really does look like Joan of Arc's sword. The famous maid of Orleon. Oh, One of your guy. favorite historical heroines. You bet. Given the number of English butts she kicked. And we all know where that got her. When you finished playing, maybe you can help me search the place. John Dark, die gedacht hat, dass Gott zu ihr spricht und oft erlegt, ihr Land zu befreien Damn. und als Jungfrau auf dem Scheiterhaufen gelandet ist. Here's something interesting. A manor in Maine, hundreds of acres of land in Catalonia, properties in Shanghai. Incredible. Some of these deeds are over 600 years old, and all signed by the hand of Mortimer. I wonder if that's what inspired my mother's attention. How come all these documents have Mortimer's signature? Hmm. Do you think all these properties really belong to him? Hmm. Hmm. These documents must be fakes. No man can own that many original works, no matter how rich he is. Be careful. The order has tried many times to estimate his personal wealth without ever succeeding. Okay. And look here. Castles in Scotland, vineyards in Italy, districts in Venice. He's richer than some European countries. These documents are intriguing, but do you really think that's what attracted your mother's attention here? I don't know. She was obsessed with Mortimer and I must confess these property deeds are troubling. If that's the case, why would she have left them? Once again, I don't know. Hmm. We'll have to ask her when we find her. And what's your take? Hmm. Why keep such a collection hidden in a secret room? Any thoughts? Mortimer has every reason in the world to conceal it, even if only to keep it from people like us. Hey, Emily, <coughs> we're not thieves. True. We're only looking. I wonder why my mother didn't make it clear what she was interested in here. She didn't have time to write it down, or maybe she wasn't sure of what she was looking for. Or she wanted to protect her discoveries. It's disturbing. You'll just have to search the rest of the room. Maybe you'll find something. Okay, we müssen noch mehr rausfinden. Hier drüben war noch was, ne? Genau, noch eine Münze. Nee, ein, Amba ein Medaillon. What is that you found? A cameo pendant. What's going on? Nothing. For crying out loud, Emily, you lunged for that jewel like your okay. life depended on it. Tell me what this is about. No. We just met, Louis. I like you, but I can't just suddenly open myself up like a book to you. Listen, Emily. It seems pretty obvious to me that you haven't come here for the sole purpose of sampling Mortimer's cellar. Stop all the clever evasions and just trust me. And why the hell should I place my trust okay. in you, Louis? Mortimer's letter, my mother's message in the book, the golden <laughs> order, what more do you need as proof of my goodwill? I freely admit that my wary side does get the better of me sometimes. Wary? Yeah, like a wild animal. Don't exaggerate. But that's what I like about you. I'll admit you are fairly huh. reliable. That's it? I was expecting more. Well, I'm prepared to trust you when it comes to choosing a French cheese. But I've nothing to gain by confiding in you any further than that. Nothing to gain? Damn it, Emily! I'm only trying to help you. Stop needing to gain something all the time. Because you think I need help. Just like everyone. You have your strengths and your weaknesses. And there's no use pretending otherwise. Ha! And I bet you found out where I'm weak, haven't you? 
Okay, oh Gott. Schwäche ist Psychologie, Schwäche ist Okkulismus. Ah, Kacke. Heinigkeit ist Schwäche in Befragung. Ähm. Was hatten die denn vorhin gequatscht? Kann ich jetzt aber trinken? Ja, kann ich. Ich würde es nicht versauen. Pragmatic, intelligent, sure of herself. Her only weak spot is her difficulty talking about herself. I don't know much about your past, but I'm guessing you had to get by on your own for much of your life. It might have closed you off, and that can be a disadvantage. It might be time for you to open up and risk a little trust. Not every man you meet wants to hurt you. Hmm. Yes, you may be right. <laughs> I might have some weaknesses, but I don't need your help to overcome them. And I'm simply not contemplating collaborating with anyone at this time. Do you understand? Ah, uh, verstehen Sie das? Sie hat mir lieber, lieber allein, sie hat bei ihren Aufträgen gern das Sagen. Sie arbeitet, sie hat einen Partner. Ah. Ah. Allein. Yes. You're the kind of girl who gets by on her own and who shares nothing. The fact is, you are completely mistaken about ah, me. Kaka. I already have a work partner. I know my weaknesses. I don't doubt that your abilities will be of use to me. But I already have all that, thanks to my teammate. Is there any chance you might tell me who he is? Mm, no, I've already said too much. Consider yourself lucky I've even given you this much. It's extremely rare, believe me. Come on, <laughs> don't stop now that you've come this far. You know that eventually I'll end up making you talk. Well, since no one can resist you, let's see if you can guess who my partner is. You're a gambler, so... Your partner is <lacht> eine Frau und zwar ihre Mutter, ihre Schwester. Hm, ihre Schwester. She's your partner. She's the one you're looking for. Well, I am impressed. How the devil did you guess I had a sister? Virtually no one even knows. When it comes to getting results, you are very good. I grant you that. You deserve to know why the sight of the cameo pendant affected me so strongly. I thought it belonged to Emma, my twin sister. Oh. Now I get why you said you had a memory for two. Yes. You can't imagine to what extent, though. As children, everyone got us mixed up. So one day, we decided to play along. Since then, we have become one and the same. We have officially erased the identity of my sister Emma. Emily okay. Hillsborough. The woman with two faces. Clever. But isn't it complicated? How do you make it work? One of us has no existence in the outside world. We share everything. First for one, then for the other. We dress the same, wear the same makeup, we speak the same. We've learned to act as one. When we accept a mission, we both turn up. This time, though, she went ahead, and I was meant to wait for her on the mainland. She was meant to meet Sir Home and bring back the details, so we could work out who would follow up. And there was a problem? She was supposed hmm. to return from Mortimer's one week ago. The boat turned up at Plymouth, but alas, no trace of my sister. Instead, a sailor passed me a message from home, notifying me of her sudden disappearance. So, my mother and your sister go missing just a few days apart. That's strange. Maybe their disappearances are linked. It's clearly a possibility, but up to now I haven't found a trace of either of them. None of this is very reassuring. By the way, Louis, now that you are in on the secret, you are obliged to keep it to yourself. Or you will pay very dearly. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. It's time to leave. Okay, seine Mutter ist verschwunden und ihre Zwillingsschwester ist verschwunden. Was geht denn da vor auf der Insel? Ist irgendwie sehr seltsam. Ich bin schon sehr so, gespannt. What do you think of our first adventure? I must admit it has been fun by your side. Same here. Okay. Was 
passiert jetzt? Oh, she's been drinking too much again. Louis, I need to talk to you right now. Good evening, Elizabeth. Actually, this is not a good time. I'm begging you, please don't leave me alone. I'll be waiting for you in your room, but don't be late. <laughs> I was sure there was a certain je ne sais quoi between us. Louis, we need to talk now. Otherwise, it'll be too late. Looks like Elizabeth really needs me, but if I start talking to her, for sure Emily won't wait for me. What should I do? Um. <laughs> Wir wollen ja Rätsel lösen und nicht Spaß Sorry, haben. Emily, but I can't leave Elizabeth like this. All right, Elizabeth. How can I help? Thank you. Come on, follow me. Wir wollen ja Rätsel lösen und nicht ein bisschen Spaß haben mit einer hübschen Frau. I really need to talk to you, Louis, right now. Does Lord Mortimer know the mess you've made of your room? Listen to me, damn it! My days are numbered. Elizabeth, I don't know if it's about my mother again, but I'm telling you, you've nothing to be afraid of. She didn't come here for you. I saw her. Saw who? You saw my mother? When? Just last night. I went out to walk along the cliff top and I saw her in the distance. She tried to hide right away, but I'm sure it was her. Are you saying you recognize my mother in the middle of the night uh -huh. while she was hiding? <clears throat> yes, Louis. I know it was her. You just said she was far away, right? In the middle of the night. And the exterior of the island isn't exactly well lit. Listen, I'm telling you it was her. Did you talk to each other? No, she was far away. I I didn't make any noise and then she was gone. Have you told anyone you've seen her? Sir Holm? Mortimer? You don't understand. It's her. She's here. Yes, I understand. No, you're not listening. The moment I saw her, I was overcome by spasms. She's here. I'm telling yeah. you, it was her. Yes. I need something to calm me down. Das ist ja eine durchgeknallte Olle. Aber kein Wunder, was sie durchgemacht hat. Nee, ich möchte nicht. No thanks. I, I'd better not. Listen, if you want me to tell you everything, you have to drink with me, Louis. What I have to say to you is of the utmost importance. Ein schöner Deutsch auf dem Tisch noch. Nur ein Glas. I'll drink with you, but let's go easy on it, okay? Guck zuerst, ob sie auch trinkt. Okay, sie trinkt auch. I don't know where she gets her rot cut from, but frankly, it's disgusting. <laughs> you know, Louis, when I came here, it was in the hope of getting help. I've only just now realized that I've been drawn here into a trap. Whoa. The alcohol's okay. <sighs> gone to my head. Here, the condemned's last drink. Mm, nee, 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 nee. Alcohol never solves anything. I'm going to stop now. Listen up. You want to know what your mother was capable of, right? You Die want to vergiften. know the reason why. Well, you're going to have to follow me to the bottom of the abyss, Louis. Either drink or get out. Okay, wartet mal. Ich habe doch... Im Inventar Krempel. Offenbart vorwiegend die Immunität in den Schwächen der Dialoge. Konzentrationspunkte, Fähigkeiten der Konzentration. Fällig. Hebt alle negativen Effekte auf. Äh, kann ich nicht nehmen? Also, Niki, was sagst du? Soll ich noch mal trinken oder lieber nicht? Ich habe das Gefühl, dass es das vergiftet ist. Du entscheidest. Oder wer auch immer gerade zuguckt. Saufen oder nicht saufen? Das ist hier die Frage. <lacht> Geh mal Risiko? Keiner da. Okay. Ich will erfahren, was mit der Mutter ist. Aber nicht so. Was mache ich? Nein. No, I won't drink. 
All right, Louie. Then get the hell out of here. You're incapable of opening your eyes, so be it. Get out! Irgendwas ist dann nicht okay. Und wir sind nicht zum Vollsaufen da. Why the hell did I go with Elizabeth? I could have spent the night with Emily, but no. I had to go play the night with a big heart. Oh, well, never mind. Tomorrow's another day. <laughs> Morgen hast du keine Chance mehr, bist abgeschrieben, Alter. Okay, mal sehen. Der nächste Tag. Er träumt wieder. Ist die Kleine jetzt tot? Das ist ja scheiße. Dann hätten wir doch saufen sollen. Monsieur de Richet, I am arresting you for the murder of Elizabeth Adams. What the hell is going on? You are in deep trouble, my young friend. Super. Ach, scheiße. Mmh. Jetzt sehen die alle, wir haben die Kleine umgelegt. Wusste ich's doch. Wieder Punkte, Konzentrationspunkte. Mal gucken, was haben wir hier? Ablenkung. In andere Le Richtung zu lenken. Was haben wir hier? Aufmerksamkeit. So, Logik. Zwei Punkte. Ich würde gerne noch was anderes voll machen. Sprachen. Befragung. Das lernen wir auch noch mit. Psychologie. Das ist wichtig. Das nehmen wir noch mit. So, langsam filmen wir alles. Wow, drei Erfolge bekommen. Was? Scheiße. Echt jetzt, Leute? Achso, das war schon die letzte Episode. Hm. Ich würde sagen, ich springe nochmal rein in die letzte Episode. Was sagt ihr dazu? Und wir werden mal uns anders entscheiden.